Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am the Sark Sinan and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season one, episode two of The Perfectionist called Sex, Lies, and Alibis. So to start off with, Ava is devastated even three days later and um, we cut to where Dylan is um, dodging questions about Nolan with Andrew. So Andrew is trying to bring up all the stuff and he's like, huh, no. And then we cut to where Chaitlin or is on a date with her boyfriend and they're like incognito like far away from campus and talks about Nolan and then we found out that Nolan texted Allison and we cut to her again she was on the date with the boyfriend and then she goes back and talks to Dylan then we cut to her where there's a news report saying that he was it was not he didn't go on a vacation by himself, but someone pushed him off to go on that permanent vacation. I don't know why I can say I can't say, so um, vacation means... Anyway, so then we cut to Ramona is off. <laughs> and um, she's trying to figure out the algorithm because she thinks it's her fault or something. And then Allison, Allison tries to talk to her and she's kind of flitting in and out of like, she's kind of aware of where she is, then she's kind of not. Then Ava is getting loaded and drunk. And then Andrew questions Dylan some more. Again, that doesn't really go anywhere. And then he's saying, I just have worked with school and stuff and la la la. Then we cut to her Chaitlin, talks to the boyfriend about Allison and... Uh, so they're driving and he tells her to turn right and they go to this like abandoned place that's very private and they dance outside to their song which I thought was kind of cute. Then Allison brought Mona food and then um, Mona is still very much in her head so Allison slaps her <laughs> and, and she snaps out of it. <laughs> then we cut to where someone goes into Ava's room and we found out that someone's is Dylan and Chaitlin and they talk and how they need to put up a front for the funeral and so they all agree to do that. Then we cut to Ramona tells Allison that uh, Beacon Security went out when he died which was interesting. And um, they can get a text from Allison asking like if y'all need anything let me know. Then uh, apparently Nolan's friend Mason was there and then we cut to where Diana Booker is on the case with Nolan and she's the new head of security and Ava is very mad about that because she was in charge of her dad's case. <clears throat> and <clears throat> let's see, then, out, then Ava is on the spot. He uh, stored his um, drugs <laughs> And maybe blackmail stuff is in there. And so we cut to where Allison and Mona talk and so and talks about the text message and how Allison's kind of freaking out about it. And Mona's like, don't show that to anybody because that's a glitch in the system. Because she got it after Nolan went bye bye. So <clears throat> anyway, uh, then we cut to where Dylan and Chaitlin talk. Then Mason shows up and wants to talk to Chaitlin. And then we cut to Dylan sees the spot where he hit, where Nolan must have hold, held the stuff. And then we cut to where Mason talks um, alibis for Chaitlin and everyone. He's like, yeah, if y'all need an alibi, just let me know. I'll say you're with me the entire night. And she's, and she's like, why would I need an alibi? And so that was kind of sketchy. And then we cut to where someone left a note. And then we cut to some type of vigil is happening. And so while all three of them are in the crowd, um, because this is later at night, um, someone said it's like you imagined it. And it sounded like a girl's voice that said it. So, um, but they don't they don't know who said it because like they're surrounded by people and we think I think the person that did it just weaved in and out. And so they talk in private afterwards and they get all jumpy. And then um, we cut to where Ava is being super icy towards everyone because she's super devastated by it, everything. And then we cut to Allison meets Dana and she wants to read the papers to the student that the students wrote. 
she says, I don't think I can do that. And she said, oh, yes, you can because it's in the contract. If you want to look, you signed it. So um, then we cut to where Ava is, again, getting drunk and listens to messages. Then Allie's window is open and we find Nolan's mom is in the house, just kind of sitting there. And they talk and um, she said that her daughter became paranoid and, you know, just to, you know, not do that. And that's why she did what she did on the wall and stuff because she saw the sign on the wall. And also, then she tells uh, her to be herself, and Mona was echoing the same thing earlier. Then Mona calls someone, and we find out that's Hannah, so she's trying to gripple, gr uh, grip reality and talks to Hannah, and she basically found out that Hannah had a baby, and that Spencer and Toby eloped. Then we cut to where Ava says, uh, thank you, um, thanks for you know, the messages and um, to Dylan and Jaitlin. Then Dana interrupts um, Allison's class and calls out uh, Dylan, Ava, and Jaitlin, but Allison covers for them and says that they were at her house at night when no one went bye-bye. And <laughs> I felt sweaty towards the end as Dana was walking away. She's like, we'll see about that. As she's walking away, she says, you know, with Dylan, Ava, and Taylor right there, she says, bring it on, bitch. <laughs> and I was like, oh gosh, she's back. <laughs> but anyway, I really, really enjoyed this episode. I gave this A+, because she had a lot of emotion in this episode, and just a lot happened in this episode. The whole funeral thing was very devastating, and uh, really good acting on these people. So I really, really... Really enjoyed it. The, the, the suspense is just, you know, it's almost, it's like a touch cliche, but it's not. And I was like, what's happening? And the fact that no one's mom just kind of just showed up, I was like, what? Anyway, really good episode. Really enjoyed it. And that's going to do for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below. Tell me what you think. Do you agree? Disagree? Tell me your thoughts down there, and don't forget to subscribe, it helps out the channel a lot. There's no membership or anything, so you don't have to worry about that. So anyway, I'll see y'all later. Bye.